Spurgeon here with Revzilla TV to talk to you about the Alpine Stars Tech One boots available at Revzilla.com. So new for 2015, Alpine Stars has released the Tech One. Around the $200 price point, this is going to be a really awesome boot for you entry-level motocross riders out there. There's going to be a lot of functionality and protection built into this piece for the price point it's attacking. Now, as far as sizing is concerned on these, sizes are going to range from a 6 up to a 16, and they're going to fit really nicely in traditional Alpine Star style. So again, there's nothing too wonky to consider when you're looking at the sizing for this. Now, as far as colorways are available, they're going to be available in a black, a white, and you can see the black and white version in front of me. Now Alpine Stars really has its heel dug in nicely to the dirt and with the Tech Ones this is going to come in at their new entry level boot. Again, for the $200 price point you have a lot going on here, a lot of protection, a lot of comfort. You are going to see a full hinge bracketing system on this side, on the lateral side of this particular boot and that's going to be a big step up from anything else out there. Again around that $200 mark. Now if you want to take a step up, take a look at the Tech 5s from Alpine Stars. You're going to bump up to a full constructed molded sole to it and then you're also going to go to a four buckle design over the three buckle design. But breaking the Tech 1s down, again there's a lot going on here. So let's start with the construction. First and foremost, you're going to see tons of TPU giving you extra protection and a lot of that is going to be molded over top of full synthetic leather. So you're going to have that nice protection of all that TPU. Keep in mind, when we're talking about synthetic leather, this is going to be something that's not going to break in. It's going to give you the same fit the day you buy it as the day you get rid of it. So again, just keep that in mind. Let's start with the sole on this and we're going to go ahead and turn it over. And one of the things you're going to notice fully replaceable rubberized sole. It's going to give you a nice slip design. So again, if you're throwing your foot out into the dirt, nothing major to catch here. It's going to work very nicely to slide throughout the dirt while still giving you nice grip when you're actually in a stopped area. Now once you're going to see here, you're also going to see the heel design on this is going to be very minimal. Really kind of just barely a half inch high, really nice sleek design. So depending on your particular style and what you're looking for, just something to keep in mind. And as you work your way up to the toe section, you are going to see a nice steel reinforcement and this is going to be replaceable. You can see the three Phillips head screws working their way across there. And again, you can go ahead and swap that out. If you bang yours up, bend it, break it, destroy it when you're out there on the motocross track. Now, working our way up through the toe box, again, synthetic leather is going to be the base of this and then you are going to have a nice TPU layer on top of it with a TPU shift pad. Now you're going to see symmetry throughout the boots, even though you're not shifting with your right foot, you are going to have that shift pad right there, the same way you're going to see it nice and gnarled on your left boot and this is really going to give you a nice solid feel to your shifts. Now really nice reinforcement to the toe and that's going to carry through as we flip this around you're going to see that TPU construction is going to continue give you a nice reinforced heel to the back of this again beefy in its construction but also keeping comfort in mind and you're going to see that comfort really come into play when you get up into the Achilles tendon nice accordion stretch panels really doing a great job of juxtaposing the protection with the comfort element and again one of the things that I really like about the Tech Ones is they do have a lot of that comfort built in and you are going to see it really Really working its way on the outside there with the accordion stretch. Now, when we're talking about protection, we're going to work our way up. One of the things you're going to notice on the lateral side, you're going to have TPU working its way up the entire side, and as we flip it over to the inside of the boot, you are going to have a full design here with the TPU coming up, but it is going to be a nice hinge system giving you maximum flexibility when you're out there, but it's also going to act as a bracing unit. So this is going to be a boot that's going to be super rigid as far as its bracing is concerned. Now the one little nitpick that I did have is that bracing, even though it looks like it's braced the same on the lateral side, doesn't have that same kind of protection. There's a little bit more flexibility over there. But again, there's nothing really else out there around the 200 price point that's going to give you a hinged bracket and that same level of lateral protection. So Alpine Stars did a really nice job of beefing up the protection as far as your lateral section is concerned for this. Now, working its way up through the shin, that full TPU protection working its way through the shin, three buckle designs. And then one of the things that I will say about the buckles on this, it's going to be their self-cleaning, self-finding aero buckle. Now it is plastic, it's not the same as the metal that you're going to find on the Tech 7s, Tech 8s, Tech 10s, but it's fully replaceable. 
So what I would recommend doing is because of the plastic design, grab an extra set, throw them in your motocross bag, and if you do end up breaking one, just throw a new one on. But again, really nice self-finding, locks down super simply, and I'm glad to see that they incorporated this into the Tech Ones, their most basic boot. Now working its way to the top, you're gonna have a Velcro closure on this. So you're gonna see three buckles in this design, Velcro open, and that's really what you're looking at as far as closure is concerned. You're gonna have a little bit of this synthetic flap just helping to keep mud, rain out. And then as we push this down, you can see some of the comfort that we're talking about, full mesh lining, but really what gets me excited about this is right around the ankle point, there's gonna be a nice foam pad that's gonna work its way around the entire inside, really maximizing comfort when you're out there in a long day on the track. Now, Alpine Stars really just knocked it out of the park with this. As far as an entry-level boot is concerned, again, there's some minor nitpicks, but really, you're getting a hell of a boot for that $200 price point. So if you want to hear more about what other riders are saying about the Alpine Stars boots that they're rocking out there on the track, do me a favor, click the info button. Read what other boots Alpine Stars riders are digging on their rides. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate. Get us on the phone. Give us a call, 877-792-9455 or simply type us out an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the all new Alpine Stars Tech One Boots. I'm Spurge, enjoy the ride.